Looking good and having a good looking home kind of go hand in hand and it's hard to conceive of that when the weather is so dreary outside. Well, right now we're going to show you five ways to brighten and transform your living space. Janine Bellinardo, design consultant from Ethan Allen, joins me now. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Thanks for coming on the show. So, you know, dark days of winter, you're at, the, you're at home all the time, you're looking around saying, now what? It's so easy to brighten up your home with five different options that I brought to you today. I think we have a picture of what the actual room could conceivably look like. Here are all the wares that uh, you or someone have put together. So go step by step with us. Um, these are relatively inexpensive things that you can do at home. We're not saying knock down a wall Correct. And, and put up you know, an atrium. Correct. Very easy to add. Actually, the least expensive are pillows and throws. Okay. And you can't have enough pillows in the house. That's how I look <laughs> at it. And it can so change the mood of the room just by switching out your pillows and your yeah. throws. As you can see here with white pillows or pink, a little pop of pink. Mm -hmm. But you can also do that with rugs, area ah. rugs, jute rugs, carved rugs, mm -hmm. tone on tone. Yeah. I tell my clients all the time, if you get tired of the way your room looks in the winter, pull up that oriental, send it over to the cleaners, and put down a fun colored jute rug. You know what I've seen is also rug on rug. Yep. Like a bigger rug and then a smaller rug, like say a circular rug on yep. top of the... That'll ground your conversational grouping nicely. Absolutely. Easy the way. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Easy way to bring color in. You can also bring color in with lamps. Lamps are actually probably the one most I, I see an example of a mistake is that lamps in a room are too small. Really? So I would say the larger the lamp the better based really? on the size and scale of the room and of course the end table it's on. Okay. But you can also do a nice pop of color like here we did with teal I or like a nice this. classic white which is lovely. And your thoughts on matchy matchy lamps? No I'm not a big thing I'm, I'm not a big fan of matchy matchy. Thank you. <laughs> my, the, really the lamps in my bedroom don't match and my mother comes and she goes what is that? I'm like I marry him please. Welcome to 2016. Some people love symmetry. Symmetry uh -huh. does add balance balance and calmness to a room. So, okay. and that's fine. I mean, I do that if I have a client that really wants that, I think it is lovely, mm -hmm. but I prefer mixing it up a little bit. Okay. Um, art also will bring in a lot of color to the mm -hmm. space, which I love. There's a couple of different ways to do art. You can do art gallery style in a room, which will very nicely kind of draw you into a space. Right. Um, this is our regular uh, art program that we have here at Ethan Allen, mm -hmm. but we also have a custom art. Uh, oh. option which is wonderful this one this type of art it's so it's a nice size because you could scale it you could do a larger you can go smaller you can make it a focal point in the yeah. room if you don't have like a fireplace and this draws you in I, and speaking about art I'm confused in part because I'm not an art history major but if you have a small space I always thought put smaller pieces of artwork not necessarily sometimes you need a larger piece of art just to give it a focal point interesting and, and then the nice thing about our custom art program is you can change the frame, you can have it on canvas, you can have it under glass, it really depends on what you want to do. Okay. And what about florals? I have a black thumb, I kill any <laughs> and every plant that comes to my home, uh, but it's a good way to change things up, yes? Absolutely. These are not real, they look real, but they... Oh my gosh, I thought this I know. was real. They, these are our, our orchids and our uh, peach blossom spray. Peach blossom spray will bring any kind of lightness and spring to any room, really. Mm -hmm. which, so you can put this in a living room, you can put this in a dining room, you can put it in a foyer. And um, they don't die. And they don't die. <laughs> they do not die. And I love this orchid. This is one of this my favorite beautiful. orchids. It just brightens up the space. So all of these pieces put together, can we show you that finished look once again? Find the colors that you really like. Absolutely. Right? I love the colors that you've chosen here. Thank you. Beautiful. Not going to break the bank or your wallet, and you'll be happier for it. Absolutely. All right, Jimmy. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you very much truly, for having truly me. truly appreciate having you here. <laughs> Anytime. And uh, coming up.